SCP-017 is contained in a 0 0.169 cubic meter acrylic glass cage centrally suspended in a concrete room measuring 5.5 meters by 5.5 meters by 4.27 meters. Attached to the wall, ceiling, and floor of the room are high-intense arc lamps, spotlights pointed directly at the acrylic cage. To ensure that SCP-017 is constantly exposed to the light from every angle, personnel assigned to the SCP-017 control room are to monitor the functionality of the spotlight and the emergency generator system and call for maintenance immediately upon knowledge of a burnt out lamp or an issue with the generator. The only circumstances under which personnel are allowed entrance is to replace lamps. Personnel, under, uh, personnel entering the room are required to wear the designated full body reflective suits and must be cautioned to not step in front of functional lights. SCP-017 is a humanoid figure approximately 76 centimeters in height anatomically similar to a small child, but with no discernible he uh, identifying er features. SCP-017 seems composed of a shadowy, smoke-like shroud. No attempt to find any object beneath the shroud has been successful, but the possibility has not been ruled out. SCP-017's reaction to shadows cast upon it is immediate and swift. SCP-017 leaps at the object, casting the shadow and completely encloses it in its shroud, whereupon it returns to its normal size, leaving no trace of the object behind.